Hi guys and girls. <laughs> uh, howdy subscribers, howdy loyal fans, howdy minions, howdy cunt wipes. <laughs> the, uh, if you hadn't seen this, the, the uh, my near miss gone sexual video, then uh, go watch it first, because that spurned an idea. Spurned? Spurred? Spurred an idea on for me. Right, here it is. I've had another great idea. And these come flooding in all the time, so sorry if they're all at once and overwhelming for you. My, my genius knows no bounds, I must admit. <laughs> but here, here's one that's not fucking stupid like the others. Let me just get the visor in the right position. Here's one that's stupid, right? Here's one that's not stupid. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up! This is my pitch to Dragon's Den, right? No. We all know that there's more tech coming out, right? Not for helmets, for bikes, right? Okay, we all get it. You got the Skull AR1, you got the NAND Logic helmet, you got the Mohawk, you've also got BMW getting on the scene with a hood. Basically, helmets are going to have a hood in the future, and it's going to be standard. In the future, a bit in the future, not yet, because technology is way too fucking new and expensive. But, right, and here's my brain thinking, right? Because at some point, you're going to have these hoods and people are going to be able to customise them, right? So people are going to create apps and shit like that for them. I can guarantee it. People will create some stuff like this, custom layouts and shit. But, here's my idea, right? You ready? <laughs> I call it Visor War, right? That's V I Z A W R A W A R E. Without the spelling mistake. Total solves. It's called visor work, right? And what this does, it uses your camera, which will be plugged into your helmet. Because I think all helmets should have a camera. They're going to have a camera and a hood. I can pretty much guarantee it. Whether the motor vlog or not, whatever. They're going to have a camera and a hood. So, here's what I propose. Your camera, or your helmet in general, has an app called VisorWare on it, okay? And what VisorWare does is, it recognises vehicles using ANPR, like the, like the police have. It doesn't give you any details, it just recognises them just to tag them, okay? And what you can do, the bikers around your country, you can rate the drivers of those cars, alright? So if someone's a knobhead driver, you give them zero stars, or one star, or two stars, alright? They're on the phone, give them a two star, on the phone, two star, boom. And then, all the other bikers around the country, that are connected to VisorWare, can recognise bad drivers. Okay? Yeah, it's not too bad, is it, right? So say someone's fucking about doing the makeup, one star. Say someone's on the phone, zero stars. And we've got to be fair about this, because you've got, also got to recognise the good drivers. You know? So people that pull over for you. People that, you know, let people out. It's people that, you know, are driving good. People that aren't, don't hog the middle lane of the motorway. Lorry drivers that don't piss you off by staying in this lane. Well, can he, he's legally right. Anyway. But that's my idea, right? It's called visor work. And this isn't a shitty idea, like the others, because the others are pretty shitty. <laughs> I'm only kidding. All my ideas are genius. All my ideas are genius, right? But it's called visor work. And basically, every time, so when I'm riding down the road, I'll see these cars getting highlighted. So there'll just be a little highlighter around them. Or the tag will pop up. And then it'll pop up with the, with the star rating. Or warnings. Say if, if, they've been, if the majority of votes or majority of ratings has gone below a certain level, it'll show red, because that person is a dangerous driver. Well, it's not going to show the person, it's going to show the car. So, you know, it's a little bit biased, but say when someone switches their car, say they, say they sell the car on, it's linked to the DVLA as well. So it's linked to the DVLA, as soon as they switch a car, boom, it's updated, okay? And you're also linked, and you're also uses a kind of ANPR system. That's not a bad, not a bad shout. I'm just saying, in the future, this is an idea. 
Not an idea for now, because technology ain't there yet. But for now, but well, you know, just keep that one on the back burner. Because uh, I think this is a, a genuinely good idea. You know, can you imagine how much safer you'd feel, or new riders would feel, right, driving, riding down the road, and you can see which are good drivers and which are bad drivers. Huh? Yeah. The ones you've got to watch out for. You could even leave comments. You know what I mean? So it tags them, you rate them, and leave a comment as well. Just saying, because you've got a microphone here. It's called, this person did this. So you've got a bit of a backstory behind it as well. Just saying, this could be a thing, could be a thing in the future, not now, in the future, when we all have hood helmets and fucking, we're all connected to everything. Just saying, it's for the future, okay? Now let me know your thoughts. I think this is a winner, yet again. Honest to God, I'm, I'm fucking wasted doing this. I'm wasted, man. I should be a fucking millionaire with a flying helicopter or something. Flying helicopter? The flying bike. A heli bike. Is what I should have. But anyway. There's no, I just have ideas. You know, people that move over because they've used their mirrors, you get a good rating. I'm just saying, right, this could be a thing. Could be a thing for the future. Just saying, right? Let me know your thoughts. And I'll see you again for another fine ass idea. Another fine ass vlog. Another fine ass invention from me, 650. Goodbye.